everybody, Jason here from Ghostbusters News, and today, the Halloween countdown, it continues, and if you're a viewer here of Ghostbusters News on YouTube, or you check out GhostbustersNews.com, you likely know that I have a bit of a thing when it comes to Ghostbusters collectibles and toys. Yep. And it doesn't matter if it's an official product, a downright bootleg, or a fan-made action figure. And earlier this year, we featured four four-inch scaled Ghostbusters collectibles made by Faux Show Toys. And let me tell you, photos of these figures, the editorial I posted on the website, it proved to be really, really popular. People wanted to buy these figures, but the only snag is that when it comes to them, they were like highly limited. I, I think there was only like one of each made, and um, yeah, I got them. So for those that wanted them, I'm really sorry. But guess what, Faux Show Toys, he is back with another line of Ghostbusters action figures, this time based around Ghostbusters 2, but yet again, the uh, the only snag here is they're, they're crazy limited, and um, I'm sorry, I, I got these two. But considering how much you guys love that first video and those figures, I just had to take a look at these as well. Now out of these four, Venkman, Bill Murray, he's the only one that is in a bit more of his casual wear. Seen here, this is the special Jackie Wilson edition. Venkman's got his eyebrow up, almost asking Spengler if he's sleeping with the slime. He's got his blue sweater, his dark pants, and in his hands, you're gonna find 1989's number one Christmas boutique gift item, that psychomagnetheric slime-filled toaster. Taking a look at the back of the packaging here, you'll see it goes pretty Lady Liberty heavy. I especially love the top image here where you can actually see the Ghostbusters within her crown. It previews the other three figures that make up this set, once again, Ray, Winston, and Egon. And then there is also an image of Peter along with a short bio. So the next three figures here, they're all kind of the same from the neck down, so we're gonna kind of breeze through them. But first, we've got Sewer Rat Ray. And these figures of Ray, Egon, and Winston, they are made to replicate when they go down into New York City's subway system and they find the River of Slime. And if you can't already tell, for being fan-made figures, the likenesses here, they're pretty good. I mean, to me, that looks like Danny Aykroyd. You'll see on top of his head, he's got the hard hat there with the light, has his yellow jacket there, the big orange rubber gloves. Down below, he's got those like rubberized leggings and boots. And then his pack and accessory, because of course, each Ghostbuster does come with one, is a pickaxe. Up next, we've got the brains of the operation, Dr. Egon Spengler. Once again, another great likeness for bootleg figure, looks just like Harold Ramis. And really the detail work when it comes to this Egon, yeah, it's the exact same as that Ray. Winston, he's gonna be the exact same too. But Egon's accessory, it is different as he comes packed with the Geiger meter. And lastly, we've got my favorite and yours, the one, the only, Ernie Hudson as Winston Zeddemore. And there's not really too much to go over here because once again, the bodies, they're the same as the Ray, as the Egon. But with that said, mustacheless version of Winston Zeddemore is my favorite version of Winston Zeddemore, so you know I love this figure. It looks like Ernie Hudson, and you will see his pack and accessory is the shovel. Now flipping Ray, Egon, and Winston around here, we got the back of their packaging. And as you likely expected, it's like the same thing we saw with that Venkman, just with the images being changed out and of course the bios. Now when it comes to these custom creations, they are incredibly rare. For the most part, only one of each has been made, which means I'm holding the only figures of these in existence. Well, actually that's only the case with three out of four because two of these Winston Zeddemore figures exist. And that second Winston, it was made once again by Faux Show Toys and it was part of a giveaway from Shapeshift Records. Shapeshift, I know you've heard me talk about them. They're the company behind the upcoming vinyl release of River of Slime, that really funky retro video game reimagining of the Ghostbusters 2 soundtrack and score. And not only was that Winston Zeddemore figure, it was part of a giveaway, but it's actually already been given away. So to Pizza Vankman, I just wanna say welcome to the club. We're the only two people out there that actually have this underground subway version of Winston Zeddemore. Now, of course, if you wanna try and get in on some of these rare Ghostbusters toy drops from Faux Show Toys, or if you wanna check out all the other awesome in-stock toys that he has available right now, be sure to check out his online store. I've got a link to it down below in this video's description. Now, that's all I've got for you here right now. As always, subscribe. If you'd like to join up with Ghostbusters News, check out our Patreon page. A link to that is also down below, and I'll see you right back here next time.